the Amazon conservation app just detected something worrying. Its tracker has revealed the first two major fires in the Brazilian Amazon for 2021. The images were taken via satellite, revealing that it happened at the end of May and continued into June, with conservationists saying that it's likely these fires will increase as the weeks go on. They said the following on their website, Importantly, the imagery also revealed that both fires burned recently in deforested areas. That is, instead of being actual forest fires, both areas were actually first deforested in 2020 and then burned in 2021. The app displays aerosol emissions as detected by the European Space Agency's Sentinel-5 satellite. Elevated aerosol levels indicate the burning of large amounts of biomass, defined here as a major fire. In a novel approach, the app combines data from the atmosphere, aerosol emissions in smoke, and the ground heat anomaly alerts to effectively detect and visualize major Amazon fires. When fires burn, they emit gases and aerosols. A new satellite Sentinel-5P from the European Space Agency detects these aerosol emissions. Thus, the major feature of the app is detecting elevated aerosol emissions which in turn indicate the burning of large amounts of biomass. This means that these fires were created on purpose, something that can have negative effects on the environment and the wildlife as these fires tend to spread quickly. The worry here is that these fires may create a chain reaction and that they will start to spread to other areas of the Amazon jungle. Researchers looking into this have said that over the past 30 years, 15% of the Amazon rainforest has been destroyed, causing wildlife species to massively decline due to habitat loss. Brazilian officials have just revealed that they plan to send in the military to stop this deforestation, saying that at the moment it's at an all-time high. However, Marco Estrini, who is the Executive Secretary of the Climate Observation, a network of environmental non-profit groups, said that this military deployment seems to be a smokescreen and that they only claim that they're fighting deforestation when they're not. He said the following, The government has adopted a series of measures that simply destroys the state's monitoring capability, like stopping environmental fines. We also noted that they have the ability to destroy large machinery used for illegal logging and farming, but yet they don't. These illegally lit fires have been a big problem for the rainforest. The drought and deforestation has researchers worried for the future of this jungle, noting that this year could be the worst year for fire seen in the area. Scientists have announced that they're on high alert, as the data has shown them that the region is drier than ever. Matt Finer, a senior research specialist at the non-profit Amazon Conservation, revealed that the first major fire was a week earlier than last year, and the teams of researchers that observed the Amazon have said they've already detected various fires throughout the region. Douglas Morton, a NASA Earth scientist who studies fires in the Amazon and the surrounding areas, went on to say the following. Widespread drought conditions in 2021 are a worrying some sign. The extreme fire could affect a large part of South America, straining firefighting resources and threatening ecosystems, infrastructure and public health. These researchers have revealed though that most of the large fires detected in the Amazon are started by humans, and due to the land being cleaned beforehand, these fires that are usually created by miners and loggers are spreading quicker than ever. Marcos Costa, a professor at the Federal University in Brazil, said the following, the edge of a forest is warmer and drier than large tracts of underfragment forests, so fires are more likely to start at the edges and move into the forest. Deforestation of the Amazon is reported to be up over 70%, with the data showing that in the last 12 months over 11 million square kilometers or 4.2 million square miles have been cut down around the rainforest, with teams of researchers saying it's hard to visualize how much land that is but is equal to around 2 million US football fields. These areas of land have been destroyed so they can make way for things like farmland, timber production lines and also cattle farming. 
one of the scientists said the following. All that deforestation that everyone was fretting about in 2020, now it's coming back to burn. And I think that the newer deforestation that's spreading now, that's what we're going to see burn in August or September, when the dry season really intensifies. The National Institute for Space Research has said that their data shows the fires are up a massive 83%, and this is compared to 2018. The fires can easily be seen from outside the region. It's reported that in 2019, over 72,000 fires between January and August were detected, saying this is an all-time high. This is the highest it's been since 2013, but what's angered many is the fact that these fires are started on purpose, and as mentioned, the main reason behind this is because of cattle farming. At the time of some of these fires, Officials in the region were criticised as they said that this wasn't a big deal, and that forest fires happen all the time and will continue to do so. Their environmental policies have been heavily criticised by millions across the globe, and people have been demanding for years that change needs to happen, and that we need to preserve this rainforest. According to Brazil's National Institute for Space Research, although 2019 was the year that everyone spoke out about the Amazon fires, Data shows us that it was actually last year that the most recorded fires were detected in the region, with scientists now saying that it's likely that 2021 will be the worst year for forest fires in the Amazon. Those working at the University of California who are observing the data from the rainforest have revealed that the Amazon is currently in extreme drought, further reporting that Brazil's National Institute of Meteorology issued an emergency alert warning locals about this. One scientist revealed that many people are not aware of the fact that already this year they've detected over 17 major fires, and that it's likely that things will only get worse. So what do you make of these recent fires in the Amazon rainforest? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comments section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.